What's going on guys and welcome to Fallout 4. Now this is the game that everyone has been waiting for for so long including myself and I've been super hyped over. So if you guys are extremely hyped for this and you want a chance at winning a copy of the game because I actually am giving away, I'm announcing the winner for the Minecraft giveaway tonight on Twitter. I'm just, I'm just going to choose somebody that I guess just tweets at me and then actually if you want a chance to win a copy of this game just simply leave a like on the video. Obviously, comment your favorite moment from Fallout 3 or New Vegas, or even the first two, because you know a lot of people seem to forget about those. Comment your favorite moment from the game, like the video, and of course, be subscribed to the channel and follow me on Twitter because that's where I'm going to be announcing the winners. So, anyways, let's get into this game. So, this is supposedly one of the best Fallouts out there so far, from what I've seen on the reviews and just all that kind of sort of stuff. So, let's get into this. So, start a new game, of course. All right, guys, here we go. Let's hope. Let's hope it's good. I know it's going to be good. I mean, let's be honest here. It's going to be good, guys. Here we go. changes. In the year 1945, my great-great-grandfather, serving in the army, wondered when he'd get to go home to his wife and the son he'd never seen. He got his wish when the U.S. ended World War II by dropping atomic bombs on Hiroshima and Nagasaki. The world awaited Armageddon. Instead, something miraculous happened. We began to use atomic energy not as a weapon, but as a nearly limitless source of power. People enjoyed luxuries once thought the realm of science fiction. Domestic robots, fusion-powered cars, portable computers. But then, in the 21st century, people awoke from the American dream. Years of consumption led to shortages of every major resource. The entire world unraveled. Peace became a distant memory. It is now the year 2077. We stand on the brink of total war. And I am afraid. For myself. For my wife. For my infant son. Because if my time in the army taught me one thing, it's that war, war never changes. All right, so here we go, guys. War never changes. All right, he told you. He told them, all right? It never changes. They just didn't understand. War never changes. You're going to knock him dead at the Veterans Hall. For oh, my God. Absolutely. Now get ready and stop hogging the mirror. Right. It feels like we're back in June watching the E3, like, trailer or the thing. Oh, my. Okay. So we have face two. We have some preset faces, which we can obviously go through and kind of select here. Um, holy crap. Oh, my God. This is going to be so good. All right, I'm going to go. What was that Will Smith? How do I go back? That was Will Smith. All right. I'm I'm like fairly certain that was Will. All right, anyways. So we have a face here. Um so wow, this is a lot of stuff. Okay, so you can change his mouth. Now, I'm not really into this kind of stuff. I know a lot of you guys are, but I really I know I'm going to have a mask on like 90% of the game, so I'm not really worried about this. Haircut is the only thing I'm kind of worried about. I like I like his haircut though. So, 
This is probably just the character I'm going to go with here. Now, we could also be the girl in the back, which would be pretty sweet. Now, uh, as you guys can see, I press I X, and guy. she kind of comes out, and there she is. So, you can also be the girl now, which is awesome. Now, let's see what some of the prefaces or presets of her are. Wow, she gets really stoned all of a sudden. Her eyes. <laughs> what the heck? All right. She just blazes it, this one. All right. Let's just switch back to the guy, though. Yeah, let me just slide it. Get out of the way. <laughs> he just pushes her back. All right, so I think that's it. Let's see what body does, though. Okay, so we can actually choose. Okay, so we can be thin, large, or muscular. So that's muscular. That's thin. That's large. Oh, God. Okay. Um, I'm going to go with muscular because we got to look cool. I mean, come on. We're in the we're in the wasteland. We're, we're an army veteran. Come on. Like, we got to look like this. It's the only option. All right, here we go. Oh my god, look at this. Look at this. Now, we are playing on, I don't think it's going to be able to show you guys, but we are playing on um, high settings. It set it to ultra by itself. Um, I don't know if it will be able to run it because from what I've heard, this game is kind of poorly optimized on PC because that is what we were playing it on. But holy crap, it, it feels so weird like actually playing it right now. We got the Mr. Handy bot. Oh my god. Oh, there he is, Codsworth. Ah! Vault Tech. It says some stuff, but I can't read it. Dinner with the Mayors. Oh. So we are somebody pretty important. Oh, uh, it didn't give us like a skill or whatever. Like in the old game. More the same. In the old game, if you read that, it would give you the skill, obviously, like you guys all know. But obviously, since we're in the intro, we didn't get anything. But holy, all right, I, I I would just stay in this house all the time. But I think we have to go somewhere. Let's see what she wants to do. Can't believe it's almost Halloween. Need to finish making Sean's costume. Oh my God! Oh, we have a baby! Oh, wait, what does it say? Law diploma. Wow. Oh, there's our little baby, Sean. We can play with it. All right, let's play with it. Oh, this is the best. This is the best game ever already. We get to play with babies. Come on. We can spin this. Oh, this is some advanced technology right here, guys. And it's playing the song from Fallout 3. Oh, my. Oh, they, oh, they're they amazing. All right. Haha, <laughs> good one. All right. Don't touch the laundry. I'm going to go touch the laundry just for that. No, I can't, I can't even touch it. I can Another activate it. Product of General Atomics International. It's so weird, like, seeing these things that you, you you know, you could pick up in Fallout 3, and now they're, like, in my house. It's weird. All right. So, uh, let's see here. Can we go out this door? No, we got a nice-looking car out there, though. Hey, hon. Can you get the door? Whenever I answer, he just asks for you over and over. The door. Oh, this guy from the, oh, from the E3 thing. Okay. Let's see what he wants. Vault Tech. Yeah, I could tell by the emblem. Okay. Um, go on. Go on. Nice to find you, sir. You can't begin to know how happy I am to finally speak with you. I've been trying for days. It's a matter of utmost urgency, I assure you. Yeah, okay. What do you want? so important. Why, nothing less than your entire future. If you haven't noticed, sir, this country has gone to heck in a handbasket. If you'll excuse my language, the big kaboom is, it's inevitable, I'm afraid, and coming sooner than you may think, if you catch my meaning. Now, I know you're a busy fellow, so I won't take up much of your time, time being a, uh, mm -hmm, a precious commodity. I'm here today to tell you that because of your family service to our country, you have been pre-selected for entrance into the local vault. Vault 111. Hmm. All right. I mean, sounds pretty good. Yeah. Oh, it is. Believe you me. Now, you're already cleared for entrance in the unforeseen event of uh, total atomic annihilation. <laughs> I just need to verify some information. That's all. All right. Um, yes. Sure. Let's do it. Splendid. Splendid. Now, uh, let's see. Ooh. Okay. So this is the chart that everyone seems to get mad at me about because uh, I always choose the wrong things. But honestly, 
I can't see my keyboard either, so I can't tell. Uh, this is going off of memory here. Okay, that's I'm actually doing it. All right. <laughs> I didn't know I could do that, but apparently I can type without looking at my keyboard. I'll take it. Anyways, so this is the one that everyone kind of gets mad at me about because I don't usually do it correctly. Why can't I exit out of the name thing? All right, there we go. Um, yeah, I don't usually do it correctly. Now, I'm going to do what I prefer. Now, obviously, I know there's going to be people in the comment section that will be like, oh, you're doing this wrong, this wrong, this wrong. I know, guys. I know. It's just it's what I prefer. So strength, why not? Perception. Let's just give us all like a little bit of points in these. Oh, we can't even afford to put all the points in these. All right, let's just kind of spread them out first. Okay, so strength, I want. Perception, I don't want. Um, endurance, that's kind of important. So I, I, I don't know if I want to have these so low, though, like these other ones. But um, charisma, I like having. So I'll, I'll leave the ones I want at five so far. And uh, let's see, luck, no, hold on, agility, overall finesse, affect the action. Okay, so let's go ahead and do intelligence because I like having intelligence in that. And then we'll do that, that, and that. I mean, honestly, I'm not sure what is a good setup for this. Um, I know there's guides out there, but like I said, guys, I don't really, you know, care that much. Uh, just gonna walk this over to the vault. Congratulations on being prepared for the future. Um, thanks All right. again. Interesting. Hey, it's peace of mind. It's worth a little paperwork, right? For you and Sean, no price is too high. Oh, look at us. Look at us, guys. Oh, there's his car. So that's what he drives around. All right, the baby. Come on, baby. Oh, is that JFK? Oh, never mind. <laughs> I <thought> that was <laughs> never mind. I never said that. I got it. I got. Put your paintbrush away. What is that? Is that like the sonic screwdriver? Oh, that's his arm. Never mind. I thought that was that thing from Doctor Who, but never mind. All right, let's go in here. Come here, Sean. Come on. How are the two most important men in my life doing? Send him over a bit. He loves that. Oh, how the heck did she get? That was quick. Where'd you come from? All right. Oh, wait. We have a... You're special. Grow up to be. I actually ordered one of these um, from the Bethesda website. There's like a special edition soundtrack. I got that coming too. I'll do a video on it once they all come, but... All right. So, baby, nice to see you. Let... No, I'm not done yet. All right. What do I got to do? Spin this? Oh, that song is so weird hearing it. It's so weird. How's my little guy? Much better now, huh? Listen, after breakfast, I was thinking we could head to the park for a bit. Oh, no, don't go to the park. You know what happens. You've seen the trailer. All right, let's just, uh, sounds fun. Yeah, sounds like fun. Holy cow, we're so buff. What the heck? Come and see this. Codsworth, what's wrong? Uh-oh, it looks like we're not going to be able to go to the park. Oh no, it's happening. We're uh, trying to get confirmation. What? We seem to have lost contact with our affiliate stations. We do, oh, no. we do have we do have coming in. That's um confirmed reports. I repeat confirmed reports of nuclear detonations in New York and Pennsylvania. My god. Uh-oh. Oh, we we need to get to the vault. Let's go, everybody run! Oh, the action's starting. Everybody's running. Oh, what is that? Uh-oh. We ouchie. Uh-oh. Where, where'd my family go? I may have left them. Okay, here he is. No, wait, where about the robot? All right, we'll see him later on, though. Oh, this is just like from the trailer. Look at this. Look at this. Come on. All right, I'm leaving her. I gotta go. I'm sorry. I, we, it's either me or you or the baby. Come on. I'll take the baby. You, we trip you. We're out of here. No, just <laughs> Let's just go. Come on, hurry up. Oh, there's the poster. Look at that. Got the vault boy and everything. Isn't that the guy who was... Yeah, that's the guy who was just at my... Where is he going? What the... Alright. Wow, we like just signed up too. We got so lucky. That other dude, though, that signed us up, he left. That was weird. I don't know. It's kind of suspicious, but all right. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Come on. Where's my wife? There she is. I can't remember the baby's name, but hop on here. Let's go. Almost there. We're going to be okay. I love you. Both of you. We love you, too. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Go down. Go down. Go down. It's not going down. Oh, we're so dead. We're so dead. Here it comes. Oh, my. Oh, we go down as soon as it hits. Oh my god, close it, close it. 
Wait, but there's only like six of us in here. What the heck? All right, well, down we go. Oh, wow. Okay, so there's a really small amount of us right now. We did it. We oh, there's more people down here, though. We're okay. Everyone, please step off the elevator and proceed up the stairs in an orderly fashion. No need to worry, folks. We'll get everyone situated in your new home. All right. That guy, he's a little suspicious. Underground. So we just... Look, you want to know why this guy's suspicious? Look at his mustache. Look at that. Like, anyone who has a mustache like that, clearly suspicious. Come on. Alright. At least it's not only us six. I thought it was only us six. I was like, wow, okay, this is a small vault. Hmm. How the heck? Oh, <laughs> Vault 111's jumpsuit. Just follow the doctor. He'll show you Do I have to grab another one? All right, you hey, follow Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. All right, let's go. Come on. Oh, this is so creepy down here. It's so, like, closed in. Like, it doesn't feel like the, the other vault, but creepy in here. That's for sure. Oh, here's the cryo chambers, too. I wonder how many people they're actually going to freeze over. Because that is not enough for all the people in here, so... Oh, this is, this is as far as it goes. Wait, where's the rest of the vault? What the heck? Alright. Oh, no. Alright, we're getting in, guys. Here we go. Hey, we have a ring. Oh, I'm guessing that... Never mind. <laughs> she jumps in with the baby. What the heck? <laughs> I guess it makes sense. Oh, this is one of those tr tragic scenes. Resident secure. Occupant vitals normal. Procedure complete. In five. There we go, guys. What happened? What is that? A face? Oh, that's her. Okay, so we're alive now. This is the one. Here. Oh, those look like raiders. Oh no, they're gonna kill her, aren't they? Oh no. Oh no. Wow. Just like that. Well, we know who we're out to kill. Wow. All right, time for us to make our escape. Where are we going? Oh, that's so sad. Like, he saw that happen. It's kind of like in Fallout New Vegas where, like, you died. Like, you saw your own self die, but this is like you saw her die instead. Come on. There has to be a release. Oh, we can't let her out either. I wonder if she's even dead. Like, did they shoot her in the head? 
Like, you can't really tell, so I kind of wonder if she is or not. But anyways, here's all the other people, obviously, still in their cryopods, which is weird because... Why would Voltaire do this? Yeah, why did he survive and nobody else did? All right, let's just go on out. Let's see here. Wow, there's a lot of doors here. Okay, so I think this is where I'm going to end the video here. This is exit zone inaccessible. So yeah, in the next video, we're going to head go ahead and escape from the vault. And uh, it should be should be pretty crazy because, I mean, look at this vault. Oh, we got a rad roach too. All right, so yeah, I'll see you guys in that next video. Um, be sure, like I said before, to enter the giveaway and get ready for some secrets and Easter eggs. The next video after this one should be a Easter egg, most likely. Either that or part two. I don't know, whichever one I decide to upload first. Anyways, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.